This computer terminal provides full access to the LCARS computer net. All right, everybody, brand new 2021 FSE 300R. First ride. Only got a couple heat cycles on it and up and down the road a couple times slow. Very first time riding it, so I got to get my impressions, what I think so far, and I don't know. I'm really happy with the bike so far, so here we go. TSE250R, so I'll come from the two-stroke GPX. So uh, going to kind of break in the brakes a little bit. Brakes are not broken in yet, I see. very first uh, TSE ride here too so Man, my boot keeps catching on this stroke though so I don't really have the uh, suspension set up yet but just kind of put the uh, clickers in the middle somewhere and haven't set my sag or nothing yet got to make sure I'm breaking these brakes a little bit Ooh, so far I'm loving this Kind of dirty already. Oh, yeah. So far, I'm really liking this engine. It's very, uh, Suspension is very nice. It's not even set up yet, and I like it. Actually, I like this SEZ suspension better than the uh, uh, Fast Ace on the TSE, that's for sure, so far, anyways. But I hit those jumps, you know, not crazy, but I hit them and uh, soaked them up really nice. Yeah, this 
engine has some uh, nice tractoring. Um, very good low end. You know, this isn't like hill climbing or nothing, but this is a very good low end. I rode one of these out in uh, uh, Utah, FSE 250, but bored out a little bit. And um, the tractoring ability is, oh, this way, right? All right. this engine and it's just a low end torque is amazing Amazing. And that's as yeah, tight. Um, kept saying that in my other video too. Um, good it's got good uh, get up and go I'm not sure if the fuel injection how long it takes to uh, learn anything but that's starting from third gear so it's uh Definitely uh, definitely got some low on torque to work with, uh, even if you, you know, miss a gear. Uh, so you guys know, so I've, I've had quite a few bikes to compare this to, you know, uh, I've owned uh, um, Sierra 250L and um, I sold my DRZ 400 to buy this. Uh, I own a TSE 250 two-stroke. Um, I've ridden Beta 300s and uh, cross trainers and KTMs. Uh, KTM uh, 250 and 300. So uh, you know, I got some stuff to compare this to, um, um, which is nice. But. Uh, These uh these GPX bikes hold their own. Now these um so I recently read a friend's uh Husqvarna um FE 350 and the frame is the same but the engine obviously is a little different. Um Honestly, I gotta say, I think I like this engine better. <laughs> um, this feels like it's got some more uh, low end torque than that. I, you know, I could be wrong, but even if it's still close enough to uh, compare, but I honestly, uh, just from riding that and going to this, I, uh, I like it. But these uh, GPX bikes really really hold their own um, and at their half the money too so 
just from my observation of riding this track, uh, ran over something. Um, I uh, normally a little more timid on this track, but I feel confident enough on this where I can go a little bit faster. So I gotta say, right off the bat, with the suspension not even set up. there he is a professional rider so <laughs> and I'm a gummy rider so he that guy that guy is amazing <laughs> he's the guy who built this track but anyways um, they just say they keep up with KTMs <laughs> that guy passes me uh, but anyways um, but you put him on this bike and I guarantee you can do wonderful things with it this engine. It's not so uh, jumpy as gonna you know launch into a tree but it's got plenty of throat to uh, Do what you need to do. So, I mean, obviously you can. I'm not ready for the tires yet. Um... So yeah, I've uh... first impressions of this engine are I love it. is um, got a nice light pull to it very controllable so liking the clutch uh, the tires that come with it are pretty decent actually um, I got, I, I'm not unhappy with the tires they get traction and everything that you give them so I'm happy with them um, I do have a uh, tubeless on the rear though, so I am cheating a little bit. Oh, but this turn always gets me every time. Yeah, these, these, now these, now it's getting tight. Fit and finish the bike, all the upgrades are uh, all the upgrades are really nice on this. Didn't take me too long to put it together either, which is nice. to break it in eventually. Um, I'm told the uh, a lot of people didn't like the uh, old uh, electronic fuel injection on the old FSC 250s. Rojo or whatever. Now this comes with a Delphi. Um, right off the bat, it, you know, first thing it started right away. First, first push of the button for the first time ever it started. And uh, seems to uh, have a 
adjusted very nicely. So, uh, idles fine. Uh, seems to be doing just perfect actually. So I don't. This new Delphi EFI is pretty nice. Good upgrade, GPX. Start standing up more on these. You know how that guy rides so fast sometimes. <laughs> but you've been riding all your life then. Oh yeah, it soaks up there. Jumps nicely. Um, is a winner very happy with it so uh keep tuning in if you want more uh, content on this bike thanks guys